Hello and welcome to Plank Name Games. Today I am starting a. Ooh, let's get the cursor away. Today I am starting a new uh, ga uh, series on Blank Name Games. Uh, I'm playing a little trivia game today called uh, You Don't Know Jack. We're set. Pretty good, Bill. Wish I could say the same for you there. What? Oh man, I must have splashed some water when I was washing my hands. Don't feel bad, Bill. I used to get those embarrassing spots on the front of my pants too. You did? Sure, but then I got the shield. The shield? What is it? Okay, so we got some weird kind of advertisements playing in the background, I see. <laughs> anyway. Uh, you Don't Know Jack is, uh, I think I advertised it very quickly on Blank Name Games a couple of days ago, but basically this is a, this is a trivia game. This particular version of the game was made in 2011 for PC, Xbox, PS3 and Wii. I'm playing it on the PC because it's the only one that I can actually do, but, um, this is, uh, this, the whole thing consists of, uh, 73 episodes. I'm going through them all. There are, there are a lot of them. The thing is, this is a trivia game with a difference, and I'm sure you can see just from me. <laughs> wow, okay. Uh, I'm sure as you can see from me just scrolling through all of these, that you can see this is quite something. Alright, um. I don't, I don't know if I need to say anything else. Um, I'll. I'll be. T I'll be I'll be turning on facecam in later episodes because this is this is quite funny, but I uh, can't be asked to do it right now, so that's that's not even relevant. Okay, but this is a uh, I mean this is this is a great thing from Jackbox Games, originally called Jelly Vision Games. Anyway, I mean I think I've just got to show this to yourself. I mean, do you want me to keep going all the way to episode seventy-three? I'm definitely I'm bleh, I'm definitely going to start with episode one. I might invite people along on this very interesting quiz journey with me as well. Well, howdy, I'm Donnie. Won't you please informatate me how many players we have? Just me today, mate. Just you. That's not surprising. Go ahead and enter your name. All right. That works. You do know how to spelunk your name, don't you, player one? Shut up. <laughs> Perfect. Allow me to give you the instructionalizations. <laughs> Questions will ameliorize before you. Select the boutonniere next to the correct answer. There will be a timer counting down, so the more harried your actions, the more money you'll get. <laughs> or lose. Okay, folks, we're getting close. Ten seconds. Be careful out there. Run dog check, please. Six. Five. Okay. Three. The thing is, I can't talk much because this game is incredibly, you know, you have to hear it a lot. I am Cookie Masterson, and this game may contain mild violence and full frontal donkey nudity. You don't know, check. Just me and you? That's good. Now we can talk real loud. <laughs> and today's wrong answer of the game is brought to you by Supreme Court Children's Vitamins. There may not be a lot of vitamins in hamburger, but there are plenty of vitamins in Warren Burger. Find the wrong answer associated with our sponsor to get yourself some sweet prizes and bonus cash. Let's go. Hang on tight, we're in for a ride. Oh, aren't we just? Okay. First question, astronomy. How many Earths could you stuff into the volume of Uranus before it just couldn't take anymore? Six, 63, uh, 630, or 6,300? Gonna take a guess. You could fit a little over 63 huh. Earths into the massive volume of Uranus. <laughs> 64 oh, if you really relax. Oh my god, really? Try really? this on for size. Five. Five dollar. Five dollar artwork. Suppose Jackson Pollock had become a sandwich artist at Subway. What would his supervisor have noted about his performance? Wastes time by precisely laying each vegetable, overuses the sauce squirters, insists on cutting bread at a 45 degree angle, or always shapes the ham into flowers. Pollock was a pioneer of the drip method, a ah, style where forceful, okay, he's a painter. rapid, and impulsive strokes of sauce, I mean paint, were directly applied onto the canvas. And in the time it took to complete this question, five new subways just opened up in your town. <laughs> Enjoy. Yeah, all right. Open wide for... <laughs> really? Who's the dummy? 
So, I've been practicing ventriloquism lately, and I'm getting pretty good. I just have a little trouble with my B's, P's, and M's. Right. Anyway, I'd like to introduce my partner, <laughs> Billy O'Brien. This game really hello, shuts Billy you up, doesn't it? Hello, Dilly O'Brien. Uh, one's made of skin, one's made of uh, what the f***? Who's the dummy? Not me. Billy, it's good to see you. Wish I could say the same thing, Dunny. Oh, just, just get on with the question. Calm down, Mr. Nan. So I've been planning a trick to get away from this, oh, Dunny, that no. for some un unresolved legal troddlings, <laughs> I can't have a task torch. Oh, no. Which of these no. tragical destinations <laughs> really? is a U.S. territory and therefore wouldn't require a task torch to travel to? The Dahanas, Cuda, Guan, or... Or Dominican Retudlik. Eh, uh, yes. Guan is United States territory. Oh, yeah, true, yeah, true, you know, yeah. Billy, is, wherever uh... you go, I have to go, too. You think I don't know that? You know how embarrassing it is for me when I'm on a date and I need you to unzip my pants? Really? Everybody fight Trump! Everybody It's time for... I'll dance, but I'm not wearing a hard hat. Which of these characters is not dressed to resemble a member of the village people? Woody from Toy Story, Bob the Builder, Captain Hook, or Chief oh, Wiggum? Be... Construction worker, cop, and cowboy are all village people. Pirate is not. <laughs> <laughs> I always wondered what village those people came from. Wherever it was, it seemed very fun and career-oriented. <laughs> Where's the Bob girl? What is this game? Say hello to Pop Rock, and it's a dis or dat. I'm gonna read off seven names for each one. Tell me if it's the name of a pope or the name of a Britney <laughs> Spears song. If it's a pope, press one on your keyboard. If it's from I know where my keyboard Britney, is. Press the number two. Each one right gets you 300 delicious communion wafers. <laughs> Each right. one wrong costs you 300 strands of hair. And God Let says you must finish this thing in 30 seconds or less. Or he will send Kevin Federline to your house. We good? Here we go. Yeah, let's go. Innocent. Oh. Lucky. Urban. Outrageous. Hilarious. Toxic! Lonely! Okay. Well, nobody's perfect. Say three Hail Marys and recite the lyrics to Womanizer. Alright. Another thing the Pope and Brittany have in common? Neither of them wear panties. <laughs> okay. Round one is complete. We've got a pretty nice score. It's a shame there's nobody here to share it with. <laughs> I'll get people on. Keep in mind, all the prizes are doubled in round two. And remember, the wrong answer oh, to the yeah. game is still out there waiting for you. Let's get back to the action. Take a good look at... I pezzed my pants. Suppose Pez comes out with a Perez Hilton dispenser. If your Perez Hilton Pez is packed completely full of Pez, just like Perez is chock full of juicy what? celebrity gossip, how many Pez could you suck from Perez's neck? Eight Pez per Perez Pez, ten Pez per Perez Pez, twelve Pez per Perez Pez, or fourteen Pez per Perez uh, Pez? I, don't know. I need you to send me a picture of you so I can draw really disgusting things on it. <laughs> what? Ready for this? A standard Pez dispenser, whether shaped like Perez or not, holds 12 pieces of candy. And they say eating too much candy is bad for your health, but I have to say it's probably better for you than reading his blog. Yeah. This one's known as Hole in More Than One. Okay, go on. Since Tiger Woods got married in 2004, in which year was Tiger Woods' wood anniversary? 2005, 2006, 2008, or 2009? Uh. The five-year anniversary is the wood anniversary, and 2009 was the year of Woods, uh, you know, hard times. Uh, what? Oh, yeah, no. Yeah, I'm guessing he wishes there was a little less wood that year. <laughs> oh, I didn't chicken is picking out a mate. Oh, what is this game? <laughs> I call this right. one foodies in a half shell. 
Given the dietary habits of tortoises, what would the Teenage Mutant Ninja tortoises most likely order at Pizza Hut? A Super Supreme Pizza? <laughs> Meat lovers? The correct yeah, answer is... Unlike turtles, most tortoises are herbivores, meaning they only oh, eat plants. Pick. So the Teenage Mutant Ninja tortoises would probably order the Veggie Lovers Pizza. Also, and I've done some research on this, very few tortoises are actually ninjas. Mm -hmm. Right. This pizza has the wrong answer baked right into the crust. <laughs> but yes. your supreme mistake has brought you a supreme reward because you've just won Supreme Court Children's Vitamins. Nothing keeps children happy and healthy like John Roberts, Ruth Bader Ginsburg, and Samuel Alito. <laughs> what the hell is that? Today's wrong answer of the game gets you another 8,000 yes. on top of your current score. Sweet. Yeah, indeed. Not even real money, and I love I it. Introduce. Don't come in here, I'm feld sparring. Yeah, what right. do a Victoria's Secret model and the mineral feldspar have in common? Both are extremely hot, both are partially synthetic, both are thin and malleable, or both have perfect cleavage. Oh, I just realized what the title meant. I think it's this one. The cleavage of a mineral refers to the way it can <laughs> oh, be dear. split along a parallel surface, uh, and feldspars <laughs> is perfect in one direction. So that's what a Victoria's Secret model and feldspar have in common. And also both rarely speak English. Hold me, never let me go. Oh, okay. Here's one for you. Harold and Kumar go to the Middle Ages. If it were like the castles of yore, how could White Castle defend itself from the marauding Harold and Kumar? Paint the restaurant black, build the restaurant in a valley, throw onions at them to blind them, or pour hot fryer oil on them? I would s One incredibly horrific means of defending a castle was to pour hot oil on attackers from up above. You gotta think like the game is. It was a bit. also how medieval chefs got the idea to deep fry meat. Okay. Step right up to the jack attack. When you see two clues that match, press the number one. Four thousand bucks if you're right, but if you're wrong, you lose four thousand. And don't ever forget. Remember the clue. It's gotta be a match that fits this clue. The hair up there. For some, every day's a bad hair day. Look. Okay. Ooh, hello. Right. Yay, $4,000. Oh, uh, no. Uh, no. That's the one. Cabbage. Uh, why would I do that? Oh, why? No, 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 no. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, have I just missed it? Oh, dear, I missed it. Uh, why did I do that? Why did I do that? Why did I do that? I know. You're gonna try me again with this one. I don't know. That's the thing. I don't know this one. I don't know it's not gonna be that one. Fight. Oh, okay. Oh, I've I've uh, I've messed up the score, haven't I? What is it? Oh. There you have All it! Alright. Well, you finished above zero. Your mom would be proud. If it weren't for all the other things you've done in your life to disappoint her. <laughs> <laughs> Good game, everyone. Donnie, what's next? Good Just game. the single if you want to proceed with continuation. Are you in the market for a new used van? When you think fans, think Vance Van Bands Van Lot. Hello, I'm Vance Van Van, and I sell the sweetest vans in the city. They've got 8-track players, water beds, airbrush murals, beaded curtains. Hey Vance, what's that weird burning smell? Never you mind that kid. It's this Don't thing here. Yeah. when you're older. Hey, 
Okay, my vans don't come with satellite radio and GPS okay. and la di da, but they do have character, character. and carpeted Carpet walls. walls. So, when you think vans, think Vans Van Vans Van Lot. Conveniently located down by the old abandoned airport that's probably haunted. You know the one. And remember, if Vans okay. Van Vans Van Lot's are rocking, See you next be time, sure to stop it guys. and buy a van. From me, Vans Van Van. <laughs> Woman in a rocking chair. Well, yeah. Three young girls at the piano. Dog eats dinner. That'll be something for, yeah. Great lady falls. Young boy with a cat. History of dance. That is definitely. Nude on cushions.